everybody welcome back to my channel I hope that each and every one of you is doing well I have you all in my heart my thoughts and my prayers and I wanted to share with you guys my March wrap-up goals for the month as well as my April goals to come and I'm super excited to share with this video with you guys because I have actually accomplished quite a bit for this little time being of being quarantined at home I just listed out my three goals for this month which were to pay debt $280 for loan number seven that unfortunately did not happen this month because of course with the coronavirus situation um, finances are not 100% stable right now so I did not do that goal but I did get my taxes done so those have already been filled out and I will be anticipating paying my taxes for next month in April. Hopefully that's the day I told them to take it out. I honestly don't know how that's going to affect since that they've extended the period of people uh, filing until July, I believe, 15th. But we already filed and I already decided to pay for it already as soon as I can. It's money that really doesn't belong to me anyways. It belongs to the IRS, so might as well give it to them and not play around with that. Then we have a savings goal of $300. I did $100 so far and then I had $200 left, which I did do that. So I have two check marks on those and I'm super Super, super happy that I was able to save $300 for the month of March and that in total what I've saved up in my emergency fund is $1,300 and for next month I anticipate to hopefully save so much more. I am very tempted, not going to lie to you guys, to pay off student loan number seven quite a bit instead of saving this money but honestly I have to just concentrate on one thing and for the month of april excuse my hand i have these new goals so obviously pay taxes 415 then i have a debt question mark because like i said i would love to pay some debt down especially since the interests are not accumulating right now but I'm not sure how that's going to go for this month, and I do want to have a savings goal, which is pretty high, of $500. I'm assuming that I can do $300 for the 3rd of April, which is when I'll get paid, and for the 20th of April, I'll put an extra $200, so that'll be $500 right there. And hopefully by the end of April, I should have a total amount saved of $1,800. Honestly, I'm really pushing to that 2K goal, and I really hope that I can accomplish it by May, which is what I would love, ideally. So that way, I can really get rolling on that debt and really start concentrating on loan number seven, because I want it out of my life now. And that's pretty much all I have for you guys today. I hope that each and every one of you is doing well. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Consider subscribing if you haven't already done so. Share with those that you know. And until next time, y'all, bye.